Hey guys, welcome back to Life with Ava and today on this and today in this video I'm going to be doing a little quick update because I have a surprise for you guys and I think y'all will enjoy it. So before we get into this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment down below some suggestions I should do for my next video, and hit the notification bell to get notified every time I make a new video and so you don't miss another good video like this one. So without further ado, let's get started. Okay, so before I get into the surprise, I wanted to go ahead and give a little quick update on my life because it has been hectic right now. I've been really busy as you guys have noticed because I haven't been posting on YouTube. So I'm going to be pushing back my YouTube a little bit because I ha need time to like just focus on school right now. I'm about to apply for a job. I am 16 so I'm legible to get um, a job. So um, I'm going to be focusing on school and my job so I will have a lot um, going for me. So, um, I will still try to get a, a YouTube video up, uh, once every week, but sometimes it will be twice every week, so I'll get one video up this week, and then two weeks later I'll get another video up, but I'm gonna try to stay on my routine of one video a week. So, with that being said, if I am not on YouTube for a couple weeks, that's probably why I'm really busy. And I just don't have time. And also, I'm doing this for fun. So, I'm not making this, like, a requirement. You know, this is supposed to be for fun. So, once when I'm busy and I don't have time to post, then obviously I will take my time and not post. And then when I'm ready, I will post again. Okay, so I just wanted to get that off my chest. But I have been doing good in school. I have all A's right now. I'm applying for a job today. Um, I think I'm going to... Um, apply probably for like a grocery store or clothing not really sure yet but I'm definitely going to apply for a job today and I will let you guys I will update you guys and let you know if I got the job but um, yeah so let's just gonna kind of go into the surprise so I'm gonna go ahead and go in with a backstory and then I'll go ahead and say the surprise so basically my mom works in this um, dog rescue um, group um, where you basically rescue dogs to find them a better home and a new home because they probably have come from really bad um, homes that are in or they're found on the road or they are um, um, like lost dogs that need a home. So basically she takes any, she find, they take any dogs in and find them a new home and care for them until they find a new home. So it's basically a dog rescue um, group. So, basically, we foster, um, we have a lot of fosters that foster, um, dogs, and my mom is one of them. She fosters, um, dogs that come in from our rescue, and one of the dogs that happened to come in was a cute little French bulldog, okay? Let me tell you. Um, and we decided to foster it, which basically means you take the dog in and you care for it until it finds a new home. Um, or until we find it a new home and people can adopt the dogs and they basically fill out an application to the, adopt the dog and we make sure that their home is good enough for a dog and they're um, stable for a dog and stuff. Well, anyways, we decided to foster this French Bulldog because we got its DNA or whatever. And right when I saw it, and this is when I didn't know it was a French Bulldog, but right when I saw it, I was like, oh, I love that dog. Like, that is definitely a French Bulldog. Like, we need this dog like I love it I absolutely fell in love with it and I don't fall in love with dogs quick it takes me a while to connect to the dog and like really love it but right when I saw this dog it was like love at first sight um so basically we did DNA test on it and it was full bred French Bulldog and I'll and that is like if y'all haven't know that is my dream dog I've always wanted that dog when I got older and had a family that is like the dog I wanted and once I found out I was like we have to like foster fail which basically means you foster and then you adopt so that basically means you um, taking the dog in caring for it and then you end up adopting it so I was like we have to and my mom kept telling me like no no it already has a person that's like taking it and it already has a home and I was just like oh you've got to be kidding like I was so sad and she's been like keeping it away from me for a while well a couple weeks ago she de decided to tell me that it's my dog so this is the new addition to the family it is so cute look look it's JP that's its name 
JP and it stands for just perfect obviously it is so cute it's a full bred French Bulldog it is only two pounds and it's eight weeks old it's literally eight weeks old like look at it it's only eight weeks old it's so cute but this is the new addition to the family we have four dogs now that is crazy to me um, I lo absolutely love this dog and I am so glad that I get to have my dream dog. I am in love with it and it will be staying in my room so it will get to sleep with me. Well, not at first. It'll sleep in a kennel at first because we have to like potty train it and then once it's potty trained it can like sleep in my bed and stuff. But it, does, it doesn't stay in the kennel. It only stays in the kennel at night. It only stays in the kennel at night um, when I'm sleeping and stuff. But um... Yeah, this is the new addition to the family, little JPJP, and he's so cute, and I love him so much, and yeah, and so I wanted to show you guys um his, like, uh pen, it's, like, not all done yet, but I'm gonna go ahead and show you that, so let's roll to the next clip where I show you his, like, sleeping space. Okay, let me go ahead and show you guys his little place, so this is his, like, little area, I guess, and so we have a pee pad under it, because he obviously is potty training, we have another pee pad right here, which he's potty training on, as you can see the spots, sorry for that, but then we have this blanket on top of here, because I will, like, lay this out on my carpet, and then he can, like, play on it, and his, um, cage is blue, which he will only be in this at night, as I said before, so let's just go ahead and show you guys what's in the cage, it's not a very big cage, because as you can see he is tiny um so the first to toy we have in here is this alligator um toy look at him get it and then we have this lip oh whoa we have this bone um if it'll focus for me this bone and we also have a blue one like it see and then he has a little tortilla chip one and then in here he has this okay without here i'm gonna just take this out. he has this really fluffy like bed that you put in there and then he has these blankets which i need to fix um that lay down in there and he loves it don't you jp you you love it but that's his little area. But he's mostly roaming around my room all the time. Right? Right. But that is... Okay, so it cut me off. I'm so sorry about that. But basically, that is all I have to show you that he's the new addition to the fam. And I hope you guys love him. And um, that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment down below some suggestions I should do for my next video. And hit the notification bell to get notified every time I make a new video. And so you don't miss another good video like this one. So peace out. Say bye, JP. Say bye.